Hi, I'm Dr. Tanya Altman with Calabasas Pediatrics, and many families in the community and my patients are asking about coronavirus. It has been all over the news media, and while there are more cases in the United States and around the world, the risk of people living in the United States is still low, so please do not panic. So what do you need to know? Well, international travel, you know, may be questionable now depending on where you're going, but I think anything here in the United States is still safe. I'm getting on a plane tomorrow and I am not worried. The most important thing you can do is wash your hands and teach your kids how to wash their hands for 20 seconds with soap and water, especially before you touch your eyes, nose, or mouth, as those are the typical entry points for germs. And this is the same for all viruses. Don't, let's not forget it's cold and flu season right now. So you're much more likely to catch the flu than coronavirus, you know, when you're out and about in the community. Also, if you're sick, please stay home to avoid sharing germs with others. Should you wear a mask? Well, masks are not shown to prevent people from catching disease when they're healthy and out in the community. So if you're sick, then it's a good idea to wear a mask, mask so you don't cough and spread your germs to others. Um, often if I have families with a newborn and anyone is at home is sick, that's when I will say, please wear a mask around the baby. If you're immunocompromised, let's say you're on chemotherapy, then your doctor may advise that you do wear a mask. But in general, it's otherwise not recommended. Um, if you have been traveling in the last 14 days and you're sick or you've been around anyone where you're concerned you might have been in contact with the coronavirus, then it's a good idea to call your doctor, call LA Public Health, call the emergency room before you go out in public. But again, the risk is very low if you're here in the Los Angeles area. Um, do you need to stock up on food and water and other supplies, people are asking. Well, it's always a good idea because we sometimes have earthquakes and fires to have about a week's worth of food and water at your home and a month's worth of any medication that you or your children take. But this, you don't need to be Instacarting everything, you know, in the community right now. This is not a time to panic. And again, I am not worried as a pediatrician here in the community. Um, I'm still getting on a plane tomorrow to travel to a medical conference. But the situation is changing and evolving and new information will be available every day. So if you have any questions, please visit cityofcalabasas.com and we will have regular updates on coronavirus to help protect you and your family.